Hello, welcome back to Tarot Time with Andy. Thank you for being here. This is my vibrational reading. Please do your own research for entertainment purposes and allegedly. So today I would like to do is Nostradamus's predictions for the year 2021 accurate. I'm gonna start with the pendulum. Here we go. Is Nostradamus's predictions for 2021 accurate? Are they accurate? Are they accurate? 2021 accurate? Are they going to be accurate? Yes or no? Will they be accurate? Yes or no? 2021 is apocalypse, zombie apocalypse. And I get a very clear no. Yay, we are safe. Hello, we are safe. No, no zombie apocalypse, you guys. He was accurate, probably, they say 60 or 70% of them. So he's wrong. That's not going to happen. So right away, boom, no. Let's, but let's get some energy about the paranoia out there in regards to it. Lots of paranoia going on. Public, some people really buy into just about every prediction. So here we go, or every scary thing. Um, they get comfort from it, believe it or not. Um, they feel like they're in control. There is comfort in some sense of knowing, but even some will say this is true too, that this will give them a sense of knowing and say, I'm inaccurate, but if you can choose whatever side you want. I will not have my feelings hurt. Here we go. Let's get some energy regarding the Nostradamus 2021 zombie apocalypse. The zombie apocalypse, the energy on the zombie apocalypse. Please be clear. Whoa. There we go. Okay. I'm going to go straight to the situation. Straight to the heart of the matter. Yeah, I think that's right in the middle. Yes, it is. Yeah, there we go. Straight to the heart of the matter. King of Wands in reverse. So that creation of story, that beginning spark uh, that enthusiasm that he had for that was inaccurate. Um, and that is weakness. There's no strength behind it. There's no leadership behind it uh, because all kings are leaders. And it was inaccurate because the wand and the strength is, is in reverse. Wand's a strength. It's spark. It is taking action. Uh, it is pushing forward with that action. Uh, it is thinking they, 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 it's, it's that, it's that path, that, that trailblazer. It's a trailblazer card, but it's in reverse. So it's not trailblazing forward, period. It's not trailblazing forward. <clears throat> oh, wait, I did, I made a mistake. There we go. I'll take them this one here. And some people are going to be broken hearted over it. <laughs> like I was just saying, some people get comfort from it. Some people gain comfort from scary stories. They, it just enlivens them, makes them feel alive, and some people are not going to like hearing this. Some people are going to be very bothered by it. This card here, and it's going to, they, it's a lesser degree, tower crashing moment. So yes, we've got problems. We do have issues. We, got co we had that scary flu season. Uh, and uh, some people are anti-vaxxers, and so this is a whole part of it also. Um, because he did make some predictions about that, um, which he was accurate about that, um, and in some regards that we would have a, a mass um, flu season, sort of, uh, but it was to a lesser degree. It's not a major crashing tower moment. And this next one is two of wands, and so that is partnership in front of the world, and basically that is sort of a waiting you know with a partnership and waiting so we did have to wait um, we did have to you know partner up with the rest of the world to eliminate it what we were just going through i got to be careful with my words because of the, of the algorithms and you know my boss here we go and a lot of people needed rest and recovery there was a lot of emotional torment a lot of harsh words, people weren't on the same page. Um, so there was a lot of anxiety. This to me is a real anxiety card because you're just wiped out from your emotions 
and from the words of others, uh, the exchanges of words, um, sharp words that hurt and needing recovery. So that's kind of um, how it is. So now yeah. I'm going to pull some more here. There's no options here. There's no partnership. There's no, no decisions. There's no deadlock. And there's selfishness here. The hangman in reverse is a selfish card. So it's basically, there is nothing going on here. There's no deadlock. If it was upright, it'd be more concerning because it can go either way. But it's not. Next card. It is basically uh, deceit and gossipy and being insensitive. Spreading the word. Page of Swords. Page of Swords is kind of a nasty, a nasty immature energy. Then we have here the loss. You know, the nasty energy, gossipy, is about the loss. Losses that everyone's going to have. All the emotional losses that people will endure. Uh, and they had a just go it energy. Let's just do it with the devil. Let's do anything to create this fear. Uh, devil is just about everything dark imaginable, you know, uh, it's deceit, it's uh, doing whatever it takes to sell a story, um, it's to increase fear and anxiety and pain and suffering. And the next one here, and getting people, you know, with the six of swords in reverse, it is to create disharmony. Um, disharmony, disharmony, it's to create disharmony with words. People fighting over if it's true or not. People division. We got the people who believe it, the people who don't believe it. It's to create division and, division and lack of harmony from the devil energy and them chasing after, let's just do it with this energy and put fear in people. And then I'm going to take these three. And we have here, yes, they wanted to create, they had an aha thing, like let's get this started with people, that would be people, you know, um, get this energy going, it's a, it's a spark to create some strength, and let's put some strength behind it, and create emotional and financial loss, the fear of it. Fresh path, new hope, removed. And people will be making some money as a result. The Queen of Pentacles. Resourceful. Being resourceful. So there's money in it. There's money in the story for some people to sell it. They're making money and profiting off it. In fact, there was a couple people who did make some money on it. <laughs> I'm not going to name names. And with the Ace of Swords, they're not going to stop talking about it. They're not going to shut up. They're just going to keep ranting about it. We've got the page of pentacles in reverse. They're not, it's not a very liked situation. They know people don't like it. And they're not <clears throat> clearly studying the subject like they should because upright, the page of pentacles is studious. And uh, the page, the page of pentacles is academic and it's hardworking and polite. So it's not a very polite thing to do. Um, and it is a weak strength in them to do it. And uh, they don't want to be shut down, is how I feel about that. And they like the teamwork and expansion, and they want to spread it far and wide. Giving and receiving help would be removed in any partnerships. So you would have to rely on your friends, your partnerships, because help would not be around for you. The chariot would not come in to help you whatsoever. The chariot in reverse... Uh, is lack of direction. People will be lost. They won't know what to do. What do I do now? The world would be in reverse. Things wouldn't be spinning forward. Everyone would be judged, judgment day. And greed would be put into reverse. So it'd be basically probably getting some other people's money uh, because people would be unable to make money. So it's sort of with the world in reverse, um, we're looking at we're looking at a lack of accomplishment with the story because people are going to judge it. And some people are, know that people are in it to make money with the four. 
and if the story is does not have stability the, the the story is weak the story is very weak and they've got their support they have their support measures um, with the inheritance in reverse uh, uh, the family legacy in reverse so they've got their support uh, it's sort of a very dark energy some people really are drawn to the dark energies or the dark stories they really get off on it um, and so this would be this support measure is to remove the family legacy is sort of the storyline here and but it's losing its steam because people are now saying no to it with the knight of wands in reverse they're not accepting it people are starting to turn their back on it they realize they're going with their higher self and they're uh, kind gentle thoughtful liked by others and the page of cups and not wanting that burden and saying no to it so the belief measures of, of the masses is not there uh, people are turning it down because they're 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 following their intuitive their intuitive their higher self and in love goodness you know for the institution of life for for uh, the youth uh, trusting trusting the process of higher self and removing that sort of um, emotional uh, they're not attaching themselves to it they're not going to because the burden has been removed from them they're not going to allow it so they're they're they figure they're going to be victorious people are going to be victorious and they will be ready for any challenge that people speak up on it that is a battle card and um, the four of wands because they don't want to have their stability um, turned in reverse they want the stability because that story makes people feel very unstable um, that feel, makes them feel very unstable and that they realize that the king they don't want these people to make profit and money off these stories and they realize that they're they're playing with them this is sort of a magic this is magic too uh, in the earth energy and affecting people's energies and their how they feel about life in general so they don't want them making money or affecting their energy and happiness and they're not going to allow um, the emotional um, the emotional uh, upset and upheaval they're just not going to be emotionally drained by it queen of cups in reverse and it makes them very angry an angry queen <laughs> and they're not going to work on the story it's not paying off and they, it doesn't have the strength behind it the emperor in reverse the emperor in reverse is a dominant in, a dominator and inflexible it has an inflexible mindset and it is a creation uh, fruition so, someone created it and is trying to grow it and spread it and the final card comes to five of wands which is uh, conflicts there's just still going to be conflicts over it people are still going to be conflicted argue fight over it there's still going to be um, battle lines uh, those who believe those who don't so that is that um, it's yeah you got these split decision split uh, mindsets um, some buy into it some don't but it's looking like more people won't buy into it more people are saying no to it because they know there's money to be made he wasn't a hundred percent accurate he's got you know he had definitely some that never came to so that is that on that so let's get some energy on the the mindset of um, the apocalypse the zombie apocalypse mindset of the zombie apocalypse we have here change is happening and unexpected income yeah people are making money off it and they it's their inner child fears they're playing on the child the fear of people their inner child your inner child everybody has an inner child in them I don't care how mature you are we all have it and we all have a wounded inner child too so they're playing off the inner wounds off other people and they like to create this change to make this unexpected income and playing on people's uh, inner wounded child and yeah they want you to be married to it they want you to be bonded to it and they want they want despair they want to create despair and emotional upheaval let's get some Lenormand some classic Lenormand classic Lenormand on the situation there we go they think they have the key to the situation we got the key to unlock everything in life they think that they have the answer 
next card and that they know the book they've read the book the book of knowledge on Nostradamus and that they are going to create cloudy days for you misery under the surface power and authority they want power and authority over people and their minds they want to create that misery in your mind because for them it's a sweet situation it's a sweet spot to be in because they're going to make money off your misery and despair yeah wow <laughs> not a happy spread no uh yes so that is it you know um a lot of people make money off other people's uh you know low moods they really do they profit off it uh so let's get some more what will happen with these people who do this let's find out what will be the cause well that one fell out team teamwork expansion reunions conflicts so but right away that came out of the center of my deck and that's the center of the situation uh conflicts there's going to be a lot of money conflicts people who uh who are doing it are going to experience some money conflicts from doing it and they're not going to have the nostalgic feelings for it people are going to lose that faith in it and uh, they they do want that teamwork expansion they want people to team up to join in on the belief system so that came from the center of the deck i'm just going to take that and they want your alliance the hierophant they want your alliance and they want to manage your moods management of your moods temperance card they want to be able to pour those emotional cups back and forth and basically toy with you it's toying with you i'm pouring here i'm going to make you emotional now i'm going to pour it over here and i'm going to pour it over here it is really mind bending stuff here so no 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 zombie apocalypse i said it here leave me a comment how you feel about that and i won't judge you if you do believe in it i won't it doesn't matter to me you can believe what you want so it won't hurt my feelings all right you guys until next time like and subscribe bye